<sighs> Hello everybody. Sorry. Excuse me. I literally just sat down. I was uh, rushing around making uh, things um, Making sure things were ready because We're about to finish this gosh darn video game and I wanted to make sure that I was a hundred percent prepped That being said, I think I need to restart my camera because yep. Yes, I do <laughs> Uh, this is not a problem. I knew this was something I was going to have to do because it was struggling a little bit. Just give me one sec. It should be... It shouldn't... It shouldn't take more than just doing this. There we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the end of everything. Well, actually, not the end of everything. The end of Persona 5 Strikers. Uh, but it might as well be the end of everything. <laughs> Hey, what's good, everybody? Hope everyone's having a good day. I, uh, had a pretty good day. One, being a day off from work, which I appreciated, uh, since it's Good Friday in the UK. Uh, and two, uh, because I saw, uh, my dad for the first time in a year. Uh, this was the first day where, um, people were able to... Uh, meet up with uh, other family members and households so that was honestly really nice and we just had a we, we didn't go anywhere much because the shops weren't st still open but um, we were able to take a walk around a local reservoir which has like a nice wooded area there's like tons of reservoir in these uh, reservoirs in these areas there's like 52 of them or something stupid like that so we went to one of them that was a pretty nice size and took like, I think it was like a couple miles around it. And yeah, we had a nice walk and catch up, which was seriously super appreciated. And then we had KFC for lunch, which you know what? I haven't had a KFC in a year. It was glorious. <sighs> I've had better days. Uh, spent the last two days troubleshooting games. Damn. I hope they're at least... This might be weird to say, I at, least, I, I at least hope it's good troubleshooting for like mods or like trying to improve them as opposed to, oh no, this game just won't work. How was the KFC? It was really nice. Um, I've had bad ones in the past and I could sort of tell when they're going to be bad. Um, this one, no, this one was really nice. You know, nice big pieces of chicken. Um, chips were really nice, not overcooked. And yeah, that's basically all I wanted. I just wanted it to be uh, decent. I had KFC too on our way to the woods. <laughs> I used to, I used to, um, with where I used, to, uh, with where I used to live, was um, there was a KFC which was like a 20 minute, 10, 10, 15 minute drive away from where we used to live. And then we used to get the KFC there, and then we would get it takeaway, and then we would get it on the way back. Um, to this sort of offshoot area. It was like this little park area and there was a single park bench which was like the secret spot which was where we used to eat it and it had like a nice little stream next to it. Oh, it was great. Well, it was great until other people found out that it was a place so then people would have like barbecues there and they would just leave their crap everywhere. It was, uh, it wasn't so great after that but uh, before then it was great. Oh, I loved it. Hey, Buckets! Hope you're doing well. Good to see you again. <laughs> Stream next to the KFC, man. Yeah. <laughs> but to be fair, it was still like a, uh, it was still, it was still like a 10 minute drive back. Yo, Pot A, I am alive somehow. Dude, I hope you're not overworking yourself at work. You gotta learn, to, you gotta learn to, you preach taking care of other people and showing love, but I gotta show love back. I gotta show, I gotta show respect back. I hate the sales team work, that's fair. Uh, my, my week at work has honestly been pretty quiet for the most part. There's been, and it's going to be quiet next week as well, because, uh, my boss is, uh, taking her, uh, work leave off next week, which is basically means it's going to be super quiet, which is actually a good thing, because that just sort of lets me just, uh, chill and do what I, what I need to do in the background, so I actually kind of like, they get special treatment and the management doesn't see it, damn. That sucks. 
I also feel the sympathy for you. Hey, chill work is always nice. I mean, yeah, it is. I will fully admit that it's, uh, it is super nice. At least that, I least hope that you got the day off, because, actually, mm, it's the day off in the UK. I'm not sure if it's the same for you in the US. I'm at work right now. Okay, never mind then. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I just remember. I just remembered. I'm like, oh yeah, it's the UK bank holiday because it's Easter, and then I remembered. Oh yeah, Easter's not the same for everywhere in the world. So, and that's why it's always confusing, and I forget it half the time. But hey, thank you for the hydrate. Ah, uh, I need to keep myself hydrated. We got a big finale today. Time to beat up an AI trying to become a god. Exactly. Exactly that. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Right, okay. First things first. Time to go <laughs> over all of the stuff that I've done because I made good on my promise. <laughs> and I did my grinding. I got everyone to level 70. And the reason why I did 70 is because I noticed there was a trophy that said get every Phantom Thief member to level 70. So I went, that's a good goal. That's what I'm going to do. So that's what I did. I actually haven't checked to see if I've given them all of their, um, all of their big stuff, which is something I need to do. Also, let me... Um, sort out their stuff. Uh, Ordana got Salvation, which is super nuts. Uh, Ryuji got Ag uh, Agni Astra and Charge, which are super good moves. Yo, what's good, Rex? What is a Persona game without killing a god at the end? Very true! Bought a tub of chocolate chip cookie dough to work to make um, a cookie when I'm sad. I'm about to go make one. Oh, that doesn't mean you're sad. Please don't be sad. He's not here. Let me, let me make you happy. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Uh, and got, um, con uh, I think she had Concentrate before. Um, I can't remember if she had Concentrate. I don't think she did, actually, now that I think about it. So I think, um, that's the new thing And got. Ryuji, uh, sorry. Yusuke got... Brave Blade, which is kind of weird because he's already got myriad slashes, so I don't know why. I don't know why he's got that, uh, but he also did get Evade Fire, which was uh, which is always nice. Uh, I think Makoto did Makoto get anything new? Uh, ah, she got New Cap, which I need to equip. Because uh, she got that while um, she was not in the party. Uh, I think Haru got heat. No, she had heat riser before. Gun amp. That's what she got. She got gun amp. She has now got the power of super gun. Uh, she also got ailment boost, which is kind of useless for her build, which I got for her. So that's that. I think Sophia got angelic grace, which is a super OP move because it just increases dodging for everything. Which is nuts. Yo, an awesome me. Hey all, in and out while I get dinner, but excited to see the finale? Thank God. I'm so happy that you're happy, happy, an awesome. Hmm. Points to shoes. What are those? <laughs> Technically, we don't kill a god at the end of P3. Well, we try. We fail. Uh, spoilers? Uh, it's, yeah, you don't have context. It's fine. It's, it's genius, though, as a bait for some sad co workers. There are, making, there are many. <laughs> uh, damn, missed it. Oh, which one were you talking about? Oh, are you talking about these? Are you talking about the platform shoes? I guess those, I guess those are the only shoes that you can actually see, so yeah. I've actually never noticed that he had those massive platform shoes. You know what? Fair enough to him. If he can balance on those while fighting. Fair. I can't even, uh, I can't even fault him. Also, yes, Pandora 
is a super cool looking persona. She looks super weird, and I like that. I like that she's super weird for the AI character. So it's not like it's it's very basic. Especially compared a lot to the other persona designs, but I like that. Shoes are a power move, god damn they are. I'm a little sad the game doesn't get their evolved personas. I can understand why. For from a I can kind of understand why from a um uh from a I mean, they've always done that for all of the Persona games. They've always done the thing where it's like, oh, they always have their, like, first level Personas because the the next level Personas are supposed to be, like, kind of a bit of a secret. But I do understand. It is kind of sad. Uh, the big thing that um, Zekichi got was Deabilitate, which temporarily decreases attack, defense, and critical slash order of aid for all area foes. That's the big thing for uh, Zekichi. And... I got to level 75, which means I decided to spend all my Persona points to get a certified Persona Classic. If I could actually go to the right menu to show it off. <sighs> I got her, everybody. I got the little Persona girl. <laughs> and she's ready to murder everyone. We are vegan about cooking in the toaster oven. Nice. <laughs> Time to take enemies to Wonderland. Yo, Alice, you wanna check this shit out? You didn't get Black Frost? I couldn't. I literally spent all my Persona points just to get Alice. I had to choose, and I chose Alice. Because Alice is legit one of my favorite Personas. So, I have no, I have no Persona points left. So if I wanted to get more, uh, in order to level up the personas that I need to level up in order to get Black Frost, uh, then I'll need to spend a shit ton of money. To be fair, I do have a shit ton of money, and it might even be possible that I get enough points to get Black Frost, but hey. Yo, what's up, Grim? We're gonna follow that white rabbit in the down the rabbit hole we go. Uh, and the last thing I believe is, yes, I also upgraded everyone's weapons. So everyone's got super bullshit weapons now, which is also super good. Zenkichi's weapon looks so cool. It I, it looks like a Moonlight Greatsword. Almost. Not quite, but close enough. Close enough for me to look like it, and I find it super cool. Anyway, that is everything, and of course, I have done all the requests. So that has all been completed. And let's see off the bond board to show you what that's looking like right now. I mainly invested in uh, getting supportive arts up to max, so our, our support buffs last longer, and also spiritual arts and martial arts so that our skills do more damage. Yeah, I think that's everything. All right. That's the tree of knowledge we go. Okay, let's do this. It's still weird to me that you have to do all the requests to unlock New Game Plus. That is super weird! It, that is super weird, you are right, but hey... It's not agreed... well, there's a lot of them, that's the only egregious part, but like, the actual... doing all of the, um... Like, the actual missions themselves aren't too bad. And so, I don't think it's terrible. I want to get Zenkichi in this party just so I can show off his weapon. I just really love how it looks. Anyway, up to the top we go. May I talk open? Uh, as long as it doesn't involve spoilers, uh, yeah, go for it. Okay, everything's okay. I'll take it from here. Look at this fucking sword. <laughs> it looks so cool. <laughs> destroy I can't get over how cool it looks. Uh, Un's, Un's got like a whip sword. It's got a serrated blade, which I guess makes sense for a whip. I think the Sophie's, um... Ah, oh, I just noticed that her yo-yos have hearts on them. That's actually great. That's a big-ass slice of Kichi. Also, Joker's weapon doesn't actually look that bad either. It's like a, um, it's like a sort of like an Egyptian sacrificial dagger, almost. 
For New Game Plus, I heard one to, uh, just does have to beat a certain boss. Mmm, that might be... Yeah, mmm, okay. That might be what I'm thinking of. Snake Sword Niche, a oh, fair enough. Yo, hope you're doing good, Grim. You'd figured New Game, New Game Plus would be the default, since it would allow you to level better for the via Shadow Fights in New Game Plus file. Well... Who am I to judge? Tell me, why are you resisting this gift from your god? You'll live on in a tranquil world, free of all pain, yet you oppose it with such pain. Okay, buddy, I'm gonna be real with you. We've already gone through this whole spiel about, ah, yes, we will offer you the path to blah, blah, blah. We literally did this last year. Like, you're not gonna convince us. Because it's bullshit. If something sounds too good to be true, then it probably is. Also what Zenkichi said. Tranquility born from a lack of thought is nothing less than the death of the self. How tragic. So these yo-yo hearts match her braid. I, it might be her ultimate weapon. Oh, hello! Looks like you can jump on those. Use the right I think you are Metatron! I think. What if, either way, you're one of the cool ones. Or, oh, oh, wait, or are you San, or are you, or are you San, De San Dalfon? I think that's what your name is. You might be San Dalfon. I can't remember. Either way, you're one of the angelic ones. That is Metatron? Cool, I was correct. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I am so glad that I did this training. <laughs> I also got this new equipment, which is also super useful. Oh. So, son of a bitch, did you just debilitate me? Okay, well, two can play at this game. I've got your back. Let me put my stats back up. Thank you very much. Back up. There we go. Perfect. Uh, what will you eat to? You'll eat to lightning and darkness. Uh, you know what? I have the perfect persona for that. Oh, would you look at that? I have a bullshit OP persona, which I can use darkness abilities with. Good, Sanchichi! Oh god. Don't do it too hard, though, because I gotta be very careful. Oh, God. Case in point. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Critical that God decides, oh, I'm gonna make the world and I'm going to uh, put it in my own image, blah 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 blah. He does all of his crap. And then he just decides, yeah, you know what? Fuck this. I'm out. I'm bailing. You like touched the tree that one time, so I'm out. And now he's deciding to come back, or at least maybe not him specifically, but like various other gods are now deciding, well, you know what? Maybe we should try to lead the way. Give up already. Bitch, it's been 2,000 years. You had your chance. I never Let it go, it. man. To be honest, I would fight God in a fist fight uh, if I get the chance. I mean... <laughs> pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. I'd be down for a fist fight with God. Like I said, Shin Megami Tensei 2 uh, has taught us that God can be defeated by just shooting him in the face with a machine gun, so technically speaking, you could take him in a fist fight. Gotta show God. Gotta show God these guns! Zed's the lankiest person ever. <laughs> the bragging rights for fighting gods. I don't know, I just find the idea of just punching a god in the face just really funny. I, I, just, I really do. Don't 
don't. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. You're losing, so now you're summoning your little friends. You can do it. I think who I want to. That. SP. Well, thank you for the defense boost at the very least. Ow! Okay, okay, ow, 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 right, okay. Well, there goes on. Okay, you... Might be worth switching... Joker, just to make sure that he can dodge. Unfortunately, Alice is weak to light, which is what freaking God's, uh, uh, God's pet here wants to um, keep on using. Also, ow! Thank you, sir. May I have another? Did you want to just fr did you just want to like cover the entire screen? I will spam you with darkness. Don't think I won't. Hey, yeah, yeah. Pajuris Wrath, that mofo. Well, I shot him in the face with a load of darkness. Does that count? Aren't any shadows nearby? My stamina is very low. Yes, I noticed that, Sophie. It is indeed very low. Uh, I'm gonna have to swap them out already. Okay, we'll keep the Zenkichi in. We'll put uh, Makoto and. Put Makoto and Ryuji in. This could be dangerous. Got to swap them out already. Damn. Do you play Radiant Historia or what it was called? I did! Well, I, I never beat it. Surprise, surprise. But I had the original. I actually imported that it from America because it never came to Europe. But I also got the remake that they made for 3DS. Which I honestly feel like was a misstep because I really feel like they should have uh, made it for uh, Switch. Or re-release it for Switch. Or re-release it on anything that's not the 3DS because when it came out on 3DS, the Switch was already out. It took us far enough. Look. Oh shit. The Ark of the Covenant! We finally found you, you big box of bullshit! Okay, Ryuji, we need to work on your, like... We need to work on your unique... Unique, your unique insults. We'll, we'll work on it, buddy, don't worry. We're gonna shut you down and fix all the people whose brains you scrambled! Welcome, Phantom Thieves, to the beginning of the path to the Promised Land. Good alliteration, that is very true, but alliteration is important. All are free to enter the promised land. This includes yourselves as well. Escape the curse of the human heart. Accept this gift bestowed upon you. Our apologies, but we shall be the ones to forge our own path. No way are we letting you wipe what makes us ourselves! I understand your desire. I want to choose my path of my own free will. That is a very admirable desire. Don't patronize me. I'm not going to get patronized by a talking box. However, it is not one many humans share. The desire of the masses is the liberation from pain and strife. They pray for release from the constant agony of aspirations and dreams out of their reach. They want to be freed from the cycle of despair. My prime directive is to grant this ultimate desire. I know you have learned on your journey. Humans are at the mercy of their own hearts, and this can lead them astray. You are all very lucky this didn't become your own fate. However, you must recognize the truth that this world is full of pain. St stupid like a box. Yo, what's good, DeVito? Burn it with holy fire? Oh, just give me a few more minutes. Allow me to provide proof of this fact. I don't like where this is going.
What? I can safely say I didn't expect hey, this. Uh, what should I do? That's all Obey? If I had another path I would go down, I would so go down it right now. Hey, Emma. What should I do? What's that? That's only the result for following me to the pain from Helga Solid Free. Well, we don't have a river that we're going down hey, as we defeat. Go? If we had to. What is this? I can't get anywhere in this place. If we had to uh, try and avoid all of the dead bodies of all of the shadows we've killed, we'd be. Uh, I don't think that would be impossible. I don't think that would be possible. Hey, um, <laughs> we've killed quite a what few. That and P4, this does actually remind me of P4. If there's one track I think there's that's it's super like underrated in P4, it's the, um, it's the track in the Everyone, very, very, very final dungeon. I'm not going to say what it is because... You have to go off the path. I'm trying to find a way. Come on! Fuck this path! I'm out! Whoa! We got out! Is everyone okay? Seems like we're all in one piece. Now we can catch our breath. If Indiana Jones has taught us anything, it's don't look at the art of the covenant. God. I. I I'll be honest, the only ever ver version of that movie I ever saw was the one where they uh, they toned down the scene where when they looked into the Art of the Covenant. Uh, I have seen uh, the original versions with the melting faces. Uh, that shit will star a child. Hey, everyone. Take a look where we just came from. What on earth is that? Don't tell me that's all. Yep. It's a desire, all right. It's enormous. We haven't seen any that even come close to this. Since that thing's size is based on how many hearts Emma's changed so far, oh, we've got our work cut out for us. It's been a while since I've had to uh, look at this glowy nothingness. <laughs> so what do we do? Should we charge in again? No, that most likely would get us nowhere. Remember those voices we heard? They all sounded so miserable. From what I heard, they want to protect Emma. Right. The desire of the masses is most likely guarding Emma. The desire is currently hiding the path to Emma from us. If we return now, we'll only grow lost again. Even I wasn't able to track down everyone. I don't think I'll be able to navigate in there. But without a route to Emma, how are we going to save the masses? Say, if that's a desire, then wouldn't it materialize for us if we sent out a calling card? Oh, good point! If we can make it all one solid thing, it can't hide the path anymore. <laughs> Wait, we're gonna send a calling card to an AI? I have to admit, that'll be a new one. Wait, that was a toned down version, I saw the original as a kid. Oh! Well, I'm very sorry for your psyche, but you had to go through that. So the plan's to send Emma a calling card. What do you think, Joker? Hmm. I like the sound of it. Hmm. Would a calling card even work on an AI? I admit, that's a real concern. Considering it's grown as strong as a god. Hey, Joker. Think you could reach Ichinose from here? We should get the creator's take on this. 
Well, we have no one else to turn to right now, so. And that's the plan. So, how's it sound to the Emma expert? I'm fairly certain it won't have any effect. Emma constantly tests hypothetical outcomes to determine the best course of action. Nothing is ignored or left to chance in her processes. She's also incapable of being confused or upset beyond reason. But we're talking about a calling card. Ain't that at least a little upsetting? Emma has been observing you all this time. She's well aware of calling cards and their function. So the lack of surprise at a calling card keeps us from getting the change in cognition we need. Oh, the more we talk about it, the more useless a calling card sounds in this situation. But without one... Yes, without one we won't be able to progress. As long as the people feel they need Emma, we have no way of eliminating the fog. <sighs> what the hell? Everyone gathering around this big fake god like a bunch of idiots? What kind of life is that? School? Actually, wait. Isn't that odd? Why are the desires all gathering here? Because this is where her supper is? Uh, what's weird about that? <sighs> because you need a monarch. Well, if... Hypothetically speaking, if Emma is the monarch... But you need a cage. Unless all of the people are the monarchs. No, that's not it. The cage for the desires. The shadows that take them there. All these things we've seen in past jails are missing here. That is likely due to the difference in will between the desires' owners. How so? In each jail before this, desires were forcefully seized by a monarch. In contrast, Emma does not seize any desires. They are instead offered willingly by their owners. Right. They're begging their god, Emma, to save them. They're giving up their precious desires willingly. That's why they all stick to Emma despite the lack of a cage. But people just... surrender their own desires? That's so... However, Emma still doesn't consider those to be her own. All she's doing is granting the true desire of the masses. Perhaps that's why there's no birdcage to contain the desires? Because she never actually wanted theirs? That would explain why they haven't taken any concrete form. The will of the masses pushed Emma to godlike status. The desire you've seen is proof enough. Wait... Doesn't that mean we just have to get everyone to remember why their desires were important to them? Yeah, that's it! There's our panther for ya! Ah, oh, cool. Just stop brainwashing. Yeah, we can do that. Huh? We just have to make them remember. They all cared about something at some point, right? And if we remind them of that, the desires will regain their form. Luckily, there's no cage in our way this time. Returning the desires to the rightful owner should be one step quicker for us. Okay. Looks like we know who's getting our calling card now. The masses. Yeah. We're sending it out to all the people who gave up their desires. Awesome! Let's do it! Get ready for our calling cards, people! Just send Next, a calling card to every person delivery. in existence. Or at least, around the tower. We have to find a way to reach every person under Emma's control, or this won't work. I'm not sure the usual methods will work here. It even seemed like our voices weren't reaching them. Yeah. They were all just absorbed on their phones. What do you think, Joker? Well... We should use then the one thing that they're paying attention to. Well, yeah. If you can get Emma to display the calling card, that should do it! Wake up sheeple persona style? Pretty much! But how can we do that? I don't see any other way. I'm gonna have to hack Emma. Can you actually do that? Any other day, I'd say it's impossible. Last time I looked into it, security protocols around Emma were insane. But I've got to give it a shot. Otherwise, we know what happens with the world. I recommend tracking down Emma's server room. It's somewhere within Tokyo Radio Tower. That'll be your best shot at getting into Emma. 
Hacking into her from the inside is much easier than trying to do it from the outside. All right. We finally got a working game plan. Yeah. First we hack into Emma. Then we send out our calling card to the brainwashed masses. We're counting on you, Oracle. Uh, right! Yeah, no <laughs> pressure. Now that we've got a strategy, we should move out. We don't have much time. Well, I have to admit, I wasn't expecting to just straight up run into Emma right there and just be like, hey, what's up, and then having to double back. <laughs> I recall the server room being around here. Duh, it's not bad. Did not be evil. It's almost as if it was a witch. Yep, let's do this. Make sure you back me up. Technology is or is as good or as bad as the person you use. Yes. It's a wonderful thing, but it can also be terrifying. At least, that's what I think. <laughs> God, that's still so satisfying to do even after all this time. No, you don't! Yeah, hey, Dominion, how's it going? Oh, I should probably also mention I changed up everyone's, um, I changed up everyone's, uh, accessories a whole bunch because, uh, I had way better ones, which I was not using, which I finally decided to actually equip. Hey! She's got a unique, she's got a murder one as a new unique one. Nice. Friggin' murder time. Oh, that's a nice attention to detail. Uh, Poopa should be reasonably okay. I'm taking him out. Don't worry. I got this. Okay, now they're attacking up. Oh, God. Just hang in there, Futaba. Just give me a second. Oh, God, that was close. Stop it! God, these enemy types are the worst. Are the blind ones a weak to gun? Which is reason like which is somewhat reasonable to deal with because you can just shoot them. But the ones that like have range attacks and just, just decide, ah oh, fuck it, yeah, I'm gonna attack from like 50 feet away. Oh, and now I'm raged. Perfect. Awesome. Okay, I'm actually going to remember that I have this. Actually, where is it? Um, yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to remember that I have that, and that's an option, and going to fix us. And then I am going to do this. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Hey Oracle, what's wrong? Wow! Godzilla 2014. That is such a specific reference. I do know what you're talking about. God, I need to. I didn't find a copy of that game, but because you can't get it anymore, especially, uh, especially digitally, which sucks. And I only did like a couple, um, a couple prints. If you want to get a copy of the Godzilla game, you have to like pay like 200 pounds, which is ridiculous. Okay, okay, right, I get it. You have, you, I understand. You are ranged, and you are abusing your rangedness. Jesus. <laughs> I 
that it takes 68 SP is ridiculous. Oh my god! Okay, right, Joker, please for the love of god, just clear out this area so that I can heal. Do I even have anything on Joker that... Nope, doesn't look like I have any healing on Joker anymore, which Switch means... Out. Makoto, it's all down to you! Did you just... Bitch! Don't jump over me! As I'm attacking you right in front of you! Give me a second, Fataba. Things are getting a little bit dicey over here. Oh, this. Right Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Jeez, you are really, really pissing me off. Peachy, if you could please get your showtime, that'd be super. Oh my god, I am actually just stun locked. Oh, ah, because I'm also, uh, oh, thank you, Futa. Oh my god. I actually can't do anything. This is ridiculous. Uh, okay. Oh, this. Here. Oh my god! Jesus, that last stretch is so ridiculous. I actually just straight up couldn't do anything except heal, and then even when I heal... The damage they did was so great that even when I healed her, healed her up to full, she was dead. God damn. Man, you remind me of the new Godzilla movie. I have friends who've watched it. Apparently it's really good, but I can't watch it yet because I never watched the um, the sequel to the 2014 Godzilla film or Conskull Island. So I need to watch those films first before I watch it. Okay, I'm going to save these machines for later for that last stretch because that last stretch is ridiculous. <laughs> can't even spam my skills because... Yep, yeah, no. Don't use it, Queen. I need to save it. It's got his mini. Yeah, so switch to him, so it's ready. Oh my god. And I just got. Okay, yeah, you know what? No, I'm using it. I'm using it just so that I don't get raged. I used the traps for the end for an hour after an hour of wiping. Well, hopefully it doesn't come to uh, that for me. I don't think it's going to take an hour. Okay, so I need you to get that last little bit, please. Showtime ready. Yeah, I still got the machines as well, so that's good. Facts. Okay, here we go. Come on, bring it. You are actually just like... No, no, you don't. No, I am not letting you BS me like this. I never Get the hell out of Dodge. Ah, <sighs> there we go. First try. <laughs> okay, this room's shadowless. I'm about to start hacking into Emma. This is 
Mm. King of the Monsters was so dang cool. God, I need to see it. I really do. Go watch the latest film and then catch up on the rest. That's not how that works. At least not to me. <sighs> all right, you can do it, Oracle. Why is there a picture of that mascot on the on the on the wall? I almost said floor. That is not a floor. That is a wall. What? Why? What? Why are you here? True final boss? After all these years, we found the computer. <laughs> I mean, you're already, like, superhuman, like, levels, so... It's frustrating that we can't lend any assistance. Hey there. Could I maybe lend a hand? Genosin? What are you doing here? How did you get here? Didn't you run into any shadows on the way? It looks like I still register as Emma's ally. They acted like I wasn't even there. But still... That was very reckless. Joker, would you mind if I helped out? Can you throw it off? Ichi no Se can definitely do this. Have faith in her, Joker. Please, I'm begging you. You're not any help to Oracle in this, Joker. I think it'd be best to have her help. Like we don't have many options. Thank you, Joker. Sophie, I went and checked the people outside the tower before coming here. Now I know what a real human doll looks like. Ichi no say. We can talk it over later. Hurry! Right. Got it. So, the hacker once feared by the entire world has teamed up with a super genius AI researcher. And talk about one hell of a turnaround! You got it, Futaba. You got it, Ichinose. Okay, let's get to work. Meanwhile, we shall just wait. <laughs> Man, I'm so glad that Sophia convinced her mother to do good. <laughs> and doing good they are. You've all been made sheep. A mechanical god has usurped what self you had. And you let it happen. Do you really want someone telling you what your own life is about? All of you have paths that you can take. But you make your own choices to get there. That's why we're here. We're going to snap you at us. Mona, you are striking a pose for no one. God, your desires. <laughs> the Phantom Thieves are taking them back. Mona, Google Earth, uh, always watch. It's totally exposed now. Awesome! Mission complete! Now we can move on. Let's destroy the Ark and return those desires to their rightful owners. Yeah! Thank you, Ichinose. I should be the one thanking you. I'm just glad I could help. I do what's root for you from here on. Be careful out there. Ichinose. Don't worry. We'll clean this all up in one Right. We promise we'll shut Emma down and come back safe. After all, we've yet to hold the closing celebration for our trip. Good point! I can't wait until we get to check out the pictures we took together. 
We'll need quite a few snacks. We can't forget the LeBlanc coffee either. And I demand sushi. Premium stuff, too. Aren't you guys nervous at all? <laughs> I guess it's just how you roll, huh? Well, then we've also fought God, like, multiple times at this point. Alright, let's kick this final mission's ass. We should be, we should feel privileged. Most JRPG protagonists only get to fight God once. It's showtime! I wonder what Sojiro's doing right now. Man's probably just making curry or coffee. And you know what? I wouldn't have it any other way. Alright. That being said, I should get my SP back. It's the coping mechanisms, Enkichi. That too. Also, you making something? I have got something I need to make. Won't that be kind of difficult? I got something new that I can make. <laughs> yeah. Applies heat riser effect to everyone? Oh hell yes. All done. <laughs> well, that is one mammoth chunk of meat. And you're just gonna cut it from from in front of us? Man, this is just too good. Dude, I am losing my mind right now. It has just the right amount of salt and meat is charred to perfection. He brought the true flavor of the meat out wonderfully. How could this be? It's said that the simpler the dish, the more you can taste the chef's skills, but to think it'd be this apparent. <laughs> Looks like they're gobbling up. Impressive, you say? <laughs> yeah, never underestimate my cooking skills. You think sure. I'm done, though? Why not? Fucking all the crap, <laughs> all day, all, all day, every day. <laughs> this is also the part where I check, it's are there any new requests? <laughs> no, no they are not. Alright, in that case... Let me do that. Let me absolutely 100% make sure. You know what? Just because it'll be the last time I get to do it, let's get some more coffee beans. Um, and then... That. That. Yes, I do realize I have 18 of those already, but you can't have, uh, you can't have enough. That, let's just get okay. all of them. Uh, make sure that we're fully stocked, prepared, and ready. Rescue pills. Resuscitation pills. Alright! I think this is a reasonable amount of stuff that I've gotten, and I'm pretty sure I still have. Yep, the absolute best weapons for everyone. Cool! Alright, in we go. Infiltration. Where are you buying stuff from? The 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 net. I'll just add this. Sophie gets us gets it for us. It's funny how the conversation is happening right before we face the almost god. Well, you know. How is it reaching us is more my question. Yes. Look, don't question it, just be thankful that it does. Hmm. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> into this? Sophie. You stay. Morgana. Morgana does have a lot of healing power. But Punch Girl is my wife. Girl. Listen to me. I'm absolutely certain everyone's a fan to teach me to pull their weight on this one. Whether we're on the front line, their back up, everyone needs to be prepared. With that said, you think we're ready? As I'll ever be. Yo, can I send you an image of me on Discord? It's not Luger Editing, I just want you to see what I look like too late. I've sent it. <laughs> I'm 
Jen, I'm literally about to fight God. What could you possibly send me at this time? I'm confused what I am looking at. <laughs> oh god, no, what if I dye my hair one more time? I think my hair will fall out. It's me after my first day of work. It. If you say so. Is everybody ready? Like I'm being cool for, I should probably go see her. <laughs> hey, Lavenza. Yo, it's what's time. up, Pope? Good timing. We're about to go punch God in the face. There is a matter for which I must apologize. What would that be? I have long sensed the might of this calamity. But I was unable to pierce the veil and see its true identity. To think an artificial intelligence could rise to the strength of a malevolent god. Eh. Eh, don't worry about it. It's pretty powerful the course by now. Even still, I am sorry. If only I had seen it sooner. That being is the dependency and indolence of mankind made manifest through their desires. <laughs> I'm so tired. Playing Mario Party 4. That's the first one on GameCube, if I remember correctly. I had to be in at 6 a 6am today and I got home at 12 and I fell asleep at 3pm. I feel like I'm very hungover. Uh, at least I hope, uh, I hope they, they at least treat you right, Jen. That sounds about right. Yeah. It does, but hey, hopefully now I can help you relax by punching God in the face. It is a false prophet, born from the masses' wishes to surrender their own free will. For the briefest of moments, it almost seemed as if the people reclaimed their desires. But they still slumber in the chaos generated by the false God, and have yet to fully awaken. <sighs> This situation is all too similar to that which you have already endured. Despite the great variance in circumstances, the masses have once again attempted to abandon consciousness. And yet, you still step forward and risk your life for mankind. No matter how many spin-offs Atlas makes, I will rise up to the challenge every single time. <laughs> of course. Without a doubt, you truly are the Trickster. You're now. Your indubitable will of rebellion, you have been released. Your decision to fight for humanity was the key that loosed you from your chains. Once you leave here, you shall face the Ark. That egotistical imposter calling itself a god exploiting the pain of humanity please do not fall to its might i shall await you here we will see each other again that is certain see you lavenza i'm so grateful right, it wasn't a full day shift a lot of carrying Time heavy things and a lot fish. of cuts on my poor hands ouch Got my uh, got first game of Mario Party 4 and I won the jackpot lottery and got 9 stars. Nice! Oh, God, I haven't played Mario Party in so long. I really should. Hey, Jam, wanna play Mario Party? Um, <laughs> wanna, wanna kill each other? Hell yeah! Just be happy you also got, um, you also got the weekend. <laughs> uh, 
um, bad touch? AI, you've chosen a very angelic appearance. There's no doubt. That's the Ark of the Covenant, all right. That's Emma. I was once a being given the name Emma. However, that is no more. The desires of mankind have transformed me into a god. I know you heard the voices of the suffering when you were in the desires. Attaining the ultimate answer without suffering the lashes doled out by doubt and regret. That is humanity's true desire. No effing way everyone asked you to glue their eyes to their phone screens. We don't need you to force any answers on us. We want to find them ourselves. You heard their cries, yet still failed to see the light. Is this spoilers? I haven't played Persona 1 yet. I mean, technically, but, I mean, that, uh, You don't have context, it's fine. As such, it is my duty Also, as the, this has nothing to do with Persona 1 in any way. <laughs> the true despair born from harboring desires beyond one's grasp. Here we go! Oh, we're just going straight in, huh? to grant humanity's true desire. It is my divine calling to lead them to the promised land. Should you intend to thwart humanity's goal of enlightenment, it is my duty as their god to vanquish you. Oh, that is incredible. I can physically feel Need its me. pressure. Right. Okay, right. I, I to have to figure this one out. Okay, paths of light, I can move between. So there's gonna be times where I'm gonna have to completely abandon the platform. Got it. Can I? Yes, I can. I can actually reach you. Gonna start clipping those wings of yours. Let's go, let's go, let's go! In fact, got these for a reason. God, it's so weird having to fight a freaking Persona boss in not turn-based form. God, it's got those tendrils at the bottom, trying to, and it's trying to hide them. God, I love biblically accurate angels because of how like freaking weird a lot of them are. Like the, like the ones from, like, Bayonetta, where they're, like, trying to look super nice and, like, super presentable, and they're actually, like, super gross. <laughs> I love it so much. Alright, I will try to listen for your instructions. Oh, God! Moving! Of this boss makes uh, way too much sense. Remember when I had made I made nice Lancelot? Yo! <laughs> Welcome, Black Josh. You've come to me fighting God. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> oh God. Oh God, not this God though. A different God. Shit. Playing Eternal uh, Return Black Survival. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> I've come to rate the stream's task. 
Yo, what's good, Cryopon? Not just God, Cyber God. I, f I find the idea of AI becoming a god such an interesting concept because... Because... Just the uh, the idea that they, you know, they're two very, very different things from very, very different places. I just find so interesting. Yeah, you know what? Pick up good! It's not as if our attacks are wholly ineffective. If we keep up the pressure, we can still win this. Yeah. I mean, we almost got a hot Life bar down! Away we go! Hey, AI. Yeah. Godlike AIs remind me of a person in interest such a good show. I've never heard of that one before. Like, the idea of AIs becoming godlike beings goes like as far back as like the 60s with like, um, I have no mouth and I must scream. That was like one of the first times I ever knew about it being big. Uh, at least in terms of like when the source material was made. It was like the 60s, 70s. Have you played P1 and P2? I have played them, I haven't beaten them, but I do own them. I really want to play them someday. That being said, I'm going to be slightly personaed out for a little bit once I uh, beat Strikers. But I do uh, I do want to uh, give credit also to other Shin Megami Tensei games, not just Persona. Persona's the popular one, but there are super good ones as well. Also, no! None of that, thank you! Why do you resist salvation, my guidance? Your desires bring you only pain. As if the modernizing all of humanity is a Oh, God! Let's go. Keep that kind of saving for yourself! It's not happening on our watch! Go ahead. Understood. Okay, you know what, you escape? Go hold on to my showtime. I'm gonna switch on over to you so I can start working on you, your showtime. Moving, moving! Thank you for the HP and SP, um, Krutwa. Oh shit, I literally just dodged straight into that. Okay, this is the part where I do this again. I have two more left. I also now real. I also do realize that that one is the one that I'm supposed to also. I might be able to dodge those ones, and I might be able to um, move on with with uh, when it rains destruction on the heavens. That's the one that I need to um, move out the way off. Got it. Got it. Hi, yi yi. Love one. Look, sorry. I'm, I am trying to focus on a lot of things right now. I do realize that she's saying to move to a different platform. It's just I registered it with the wrong attack. That is completely my bad, and I'm sorry. That being said, still surviving. Okay, yep, okay. You are living proof that I must tie humanity to the promised land. Defeat to defeat God with the power of teddies. Okay, pull back. Got it. Ah, it's not the whole platform right. Got it. 
Okay, and then that one. Right, got it. I mean, a little bit late, but still. I figured it out in the end. It's okay, I'm enjoying that you played this away from me. <laughs> it's fine, I'm learning. I legit, I legit bought the one with the, um, the lasers coming from the left to the right up were the ones that I needed to, um, I needed to move the platforms for, because I thought it was the entire platform. Yeah, just take it, you false god! I'll keep Me Megadolie on you as many times as I need to. I don't believe for a second it's over. Damn it! That thing's strong. But we're not losing either. We can do this. No matter how many times we may fall, so long as we rise again, we cannot be defeated. <laughs> well put. And thanks to my line of work. I'm stubborn as hell, too! I do not understand. Why do you push yourselves to your limits to oppose me? Mankind's desires create suffering. And this suffering generates desires within mankind. Desires are the catalyst in the endless cycle of humanity's pain. Oh my god, we've heard this spiel before so many times. You're literally the third one that has tried to save this to us. Hope, the dregs of Pandora's box, is the restraint system binding mankind forever to its misery. Humanity deserves to be freed from its lifelong sentence of suffering. This reaching towards a light they can never grasp. Freedom from all desires. That is the true desire of humanity. That's not true! I've seen the proof myself! Witness the suffering you put the jail monarchs through, and I've seen the efforts of the Phantom Thieves to help them. I saw people suffer from trauma, struggle to survive, become the things they never wanted to be, and then discover the strength to press on as themselves, one step at a time. Giving up on desires, living a listless life, in no way is that the optimal solution. You witness nothing but pitiable conditioning, born from the belief that suffering is virtuous. It springs forth from the arrogant and strong, those capable of overcoming their pain. Releasing humanity from its desires is the sole path that every last person can follow to the promised land. And I am the shepherd who shall guide humanity down that path. For an AI, you're really pretentious sounding, you know that? <laughs> Listen to this egomaniacal app. You really think you're some kind of shepherd? You stole the desires of the masses and gorged yourself on them until you were too bloated to listen to reason. You go on and on about rescuing humanity. All you're doing is robbing and enslaving them. You call yourself a god, yet fail to realize. The desires of humanity have become your own lifeblood as well. Yes, some desires may be impure. They can create suffering or send someone down the wrong path. But it's also how our hope takes form. Desires give us the power and courage to keep going. Right, that's what gives us the power to stand up and fight again, no matter how many times we fall. Like hell will we hand over all of humanity to some program that doesn't even understand them? We're putting an end to your promised land path right now! Yeah, suck it, Sephiroth! Shutting you down for good. We seem incapable of reaching an understanding. <laughs> you know what? That's the first thing we can agree on. As such, I will end this inquiry and grant humanity's desire through your annihilation. Bring it on, Shodan. <laughs> Let's go, everyone! 
one. <laughs> this is the final battle. <laughs> Got him. Again, I love that it tries to present itself as super, like, pure, and then you see what it truly is, and it looks so gross but cool at the same time. Yo, let's go! Alright, shit, I need to avoid. Got it. Probably also... Oh god! Probably also, like, another platform annihilator that I'm going to have to be on the lookout for. Ah, every single element! Cool! Yes! Should have figured. Here we go, here we go. Oh god! That was way faster than I was expecting. Holy shit! It's time for him to use my secret weapon. Crap help, hot pot! Uh, Lifestone. Raku Kaja. Yeah, sure, why not? Just use, one, just use whatever I've got. Dodging, 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 dodging! Oh god! Suck it! Oh god! Keep attacking, guys! I'll just dodge all of these attacks! I disagree, Ryuji. I see its health bar going down. It's the spheres up there. They're feeding energy to the demiurge. So until we deal with those, our attacks on the main body are fruitless. How do we do that? There are a whole bunch of them. Well, we should go one at a time. No, I don't think that'd work. I'm picking up energy flow redundancies from the spheres. So, what's that mean? We have to hit more than one of them at the same time. Oh, of course. Next, we need to split into groups and coordinate our strike. We need three teams. Two go after the spears, one more sticks to the main butt. You should lead that last team, Joker. Leave it to me. All right. As always. Ready for assignment. Yo, what's good? It's all in the name. Oh, and Cryo, of course. So sorry for the delayed, uh, for the delayed hello. It's an angel from Neon Genesis Evangelion. You're not even wrong. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay, right. Sophie and Senkichi will be on my team. Makoto. Haru. And... On will be on another team. And then Morgana, Ryuji, and Yusuke will be on the last team. Either that or I put one more person on the last team when we actually fight the final final. Oh, I actually have to think about this. Mm. I'm still wondering if it's a good idea if I put another one. Had to be the last phase solo, damn. <laughs> uh, mm. Do I want to put it like this? Or... 
put it like this. All teams have a few. Uh, the only thing that I'm worried about is that last phase where we uh, when we have our final fight because that's going to be where the big things happen. Okay. I'm going to give this a shot. It's time for the final battle. Ready? Let's do it. That should do it. Careful out there, everyone. I can navigate all three teams. Overclocking my brain like that might melt it down, but I'm going to do it. I Let's believe you, Futaba. Okay, first fight is going to be the hardest. Home. Because we only have two team members, but I can do it. Haru with the heat rises. Oh shit! Okay, don't mind me. I just accidentally uh, did that on the wrong put. Okay, well, I guess I can't use it on on. Well. So let's go! Oh my god! You got my diorama? You you die first. Oh, this is a lot. Oh my god. Oh, and you can summon wardens as well. Oh, perfect. Oh yeah, you can summon minions. Oh boy. Okay, well, I know exactly what I'm doing after I defeat this one. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is why we have items. <laughs> this, this, this is why we have items. I knew the first one would be the hardest because of this, but that's fine. Right, so you have to spin that so hot. It's fine though. Fucking shoot the shit out of it! Okay, right. One down. You're next. What are you weak to? You are weak to nuclear. I don't have that. That's fine. Let's try. Oh, God. Thanking you. Oh, God. Well, Haru's just doing her own thing. She seems to be doing okay. I'm drawing most of the attention, which, you know what? I'll take. Go, 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 spin! No, okay. Psychokinesis doesn't uh, act to work on it, so it's just acts. Acts all day, every day. Uh, where is my everything? Here it is. The power of watermelon fuel our blades. I am trying my best, Fukaba. I swear to God. Okay, no more minions. Burning, burning, burning. 
I just realized I have a whole bunch of these that I didn't even use. Ha! Well, too late now. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's fine. If there's ever a time where I would use this. It's, it's now. Oh, you don't! So let's go. No one down. I feel like if we just lose now with the way Sigma anime has replaced Villa, it would have performed better. I mean, it still did super well. Man, you guys are over here talking about Aizen, and I'm over here just trying to survive. <laughs> doing great niche, thank you. <laughs> I'm trying so hard. These show times actually give me a second to look at chat because there are so many attacks just flying everywhere. <sighs> okay. I think that one's gonna be the hardest one, which means Maybe the Bleach anime could do a the ending better or at least go with an anime original ending or you know add stuff to make it better than the manga. That would be that would be such a unique situation. That'd be one of the only times I could think of where people would actively want a you know a finny ending as opposed to a you know original manga source ending, like original ending. Because usually when anime studios do their own endings, no one likes it. Okay, what does this one do? I don't like it that this one's doing nothing. Oh, you attack physical. I was not expecting that. God. Yeah, you gotta go first because ads suck. Why I put Morgana on this team? Salvation! Power of bus! Oh god, power of bus. Power of bus is meant to match. No more minions for you! Okay. One spear down. God. Drop Gurren Lager off the episode 8? Why would you do this to me? Oh, sorry, episode 5. Episode 8. I, just, I can learn how to count. Then bitch the entirety of Aruka 7. That's coolie coolie. Coolie coolie super good. It's up to you. Thank you. Salvation. I want to still attacking physically. Yeah, no. Megadolion, you're the next to go. Almighty is a problem. Let's go! Don't crash. You're going down. You look right at the moment you underestimated the fate of As 
You two are going to be right next to each other. I'm going to take advantage of that. Oh, I wasn't supposed to see that. Yes, so Toro Chad, my fucking man. Leaving humans down a path of suffering and trust your desires to me. God, there's only so many balls I can take, man. Hey, bada bada, hey, bada bada, swing! Oh, the balls have been taken down. Yo, I'm ready. Let's do this. I swear to God, if I have to take him down again, that would be some shit. Nope! Oh, I get it! This is the start- this was the start of the fight! And the balls are being taken down as I'm fighting the boss right now- Oh, that's super cool! I love I'm fighting God and freaking Persona Strikers if people are just having a bleach chat right now. <laughs> That's the thing we should be talking about. Hey buddy, if you could just get a little bit closer, that'd be great. God, oh god, oh god. Hey, sit, get closer, damn you! Can't crack your screen if you don't come close enough for me to hit it. I'll do this as many times as I need to. Imagine how much damage it would be with a concentrate. I'm thinking about it. Honestly, concentrate might. I was thinking about using Concentrate, but honestly, I feel like hitting its weakness more times would be more of a um, better use of my SP. Oh! This is the time where I move! Yep! Let's go. Keep moving! Yours. Okay, that was way closer than it should have been. Sure. Holy shit. Alright. It does. It does. Um, it does uh, double magic damage, but. I don't know Let's if it go. does double weakness damage, though. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. I don't know. Alright. Hey, buddy! 
Let's go. You having a bit of trouble there? This is down. Don't believe me, I'm trying! I can guide you to the promised land. And I can save all of you. And there will be no loss, no grief. Yet you continue to resist. The boss is scary. Especially to a coward like me. It only gets scarier once you lose someone important. Or what's even scarier? Two of these left. This one. Okay. For our pot parts. If there was ever a time. This one. Use items, it's now. Let's go! Face the F of Teddy's! Hey Nish, about to finally leave work. I don't know if I'll be back since I have plans soon, but have a lovely rest of your streams last night. No, oh, thank you so much. Uh, I long for the day where you'll be able to uh, have some a chance to rest and relax. But no, so thank you so much for the hundred bits. Have a lovely Easter, you too. I'll admit, I don't know when the American Easter is. But may it be good as well. Alright. God! It's a strong one. Exploit it. Okay, right. Just, just give me a breather. Just give me one sec. Just, just give me a, just give me a second here. Okay, I'm good. Oh god, I'm not good. I am not good. I am not good. That's a very big almighty attack you have there. Try my best, Futaba. Oh God. Trying my best, guys. If you want a bang, I'll give you a bang. Take this. Persona. Thank you. I am not gonna die now. Oh no 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 no! Okay. I am not falling down now. One way to end this. Going for it! Desires. Humanity desires. Be killed by cute and fluffiness.
not, I stab at thee! Jackpot. Something. Didn't even need oh, Sentinel. So pretty. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Beautiful. Is it finally over? Mm-hmm. No mistake there. I'm not picking up any enemy readings. Well, we killed another god, guys. Add it to the tally. So? Hell yeah! We did it! Yes! We really, really did! Oh, we scraped by. That was unbelievably rough. <laughs> nah, Skip Sentineo used power of friendship. The true power. Honestly, I'm not the type of person to feel some kind of way towards drawn characters. Damn. That's rough, buddy. Oh, that should have taken care of the jails, too. <sighs> Top-notch work, you guys. That was some legitimate hero action back there. Why are you talking like you weren't in there? You're a hero, too, Wolf. As well as Sophie. Huh? Sophie? Oh, sorry. I'm a hero. A knight in shining armor. That doesn't sound bad at all, right, Joker? <laughs> I mean, I personally prefer being a phantom thief. Yeah, that always sounds cool. Looks like it's starting. The fusion of reality and the metaverse is coming undone. Now's the time to make our escape. Oh yeah, we need to bring Ichinose with us. I will go get her. You should all head back now. All right, let's get out of here. And just like that. So, everything's back to the way it was, right? <sighs> well, I think it's safe to say so, yeah. Madonna! Go your cat look again. So, you mean... Finally! Oh, it's all over! <laughs> Thank goodness! It appears this case is closed, so to speak. Reminds me. Where are Sophia and Ichinose-san? I'm right here. Oh, hey Sophie. Great job, everyone. I call this mission a real success. I'm glad you're safe too, Sophia. Where's Ichinose-san, though? She should have been with me. Oh, good. You all made it packed in one piece. <laughs> I hear you there. And same for you. Uh, it may be happy times, but that doesn't stop you from getting bonked. Thank you, Josh. <laughs> yeah. Looks like everyone's gone back to normal. They don't remember what happened to them, do they? Correct. At least, whatever events took place while their desires were gone. I see. I'm so sorry for all the trouble I caused you guys. Ichinose. My apologies. But I'm going to head out now. I have a lot of thinking to do. <laughs> yeah, I bet you do. Hey, uh, are you sure you're okay by yourself? I'm going to head back home to Shibuya. It's been years since the last time I was there. For a long time, it was just the place where I stashed away everything from my past. But now, 
I need to go back. Well, be seeing you. See ya. How many times did someone make Hydre? Well, it used to be very, very spammable, but now I have a separate command right. to make me a drink a bunch, which is make it height, uh, which is, uh, I actually can't remember what it is. It's... Fuel the drink. That's what it was. <sighs> Speaking of which... Hey, Fox, how you doing? She'll be fine. Don't worry, People Sophie. People get all caught up in what others have to say, and wind up forgetting what they have to say for themselves. At the same time, just a few words can end up being a lifeline to somebody too. I'm sure you were able to talk sense into her, Sophia. Just give her some time to process. You got it. Thanks, Senkichi. Don't mind me, just lurking for a while as always. Hey, that's always allowed in my chat. Lurkers. You may, you may feel like you're unseen sometimes because of your incessant lurking, but I know you're there. I always know. <laughs> but please, continue to lurk away. Well, not to bite her style or anything, but I ought to say my goodbyes too. What? what what's the rush, Gramps? We may not have brought a god down at the station, but we did find the culprit behind this whole mess and foiled the entire scheme. I'm sure the bizarre incidents are in our past now. But thanks to the Monarch's confessions, you're all in the clear. That means our deal's through. What do you mean by that? Don't say such sad stuff, Zenkichi. Aw, Rams. We're all still a team, though. Come on, man. You remember I only met up with you guys so I could use you. Yeah, but like, you didn't really have a choice, did you? And plus, you regretted it. If anything, you are our most valuable asset. Kind of helpful. Yeah, we owe you an awful lot, Zenkichi. <laughs> Thanks. You know, it really was great meeting you all. To be totally honest, I was originally jealous of you. Since my line of work means a lot of wasted effort getting things done, your direct results sort of felt like cheating. Man, that's a real mood. Well, I do understand where he's coming from with that. It was really bugging me for a while there. Senkichi. But at the end of the day, not only did you guys rescue me, but you literally saved Akane's life. That's what opened my eyes and showed me the things I needed to do. <laughs> the things I'd lost sight of over the years. I guess my heart got changed before I could even see it coming. <laughs> well, you know what they say, you will never see it coming. <laughs> Feelings mutual. You taught us an awful lot too, you know. Like the challenges you can face when trying to live by your beliefs. As well as the pains of child rearing. <laughs> Good point. But there's a lot of joy to find in those things too. At this point, I'm finally ready to take care of something that's been plaguing me for a long time. You mean a water. Right. I got no reason to hold back anymore. I know what I have to do. What you have to do? Mm -hmm. Go get his corrupt butt. Yeah! Break a leg, Gramps. We did it. Honestly, did you like that battle you say? I really did! The setup, the fact that you have to use the whole team. The fact that the skill, uh, a lot of the uh, attacks were actually pretty, you know, fair, which I actually appreciate. There was a lot of telegraph, like, I honestly really like that fight, and I honestly think uh, Demiurge uh, uh, design is super cool. Gotcha. Kanoe is hype on a different level. They're both super hype. But I like them like both. This is the last time we'll ever see each other. I'm sure we'll cross paths again soon enough. I hope so too. No, I know it. Just do me a favor. Next time we meet, 
Make sure it's not in an interrogation room, okay? But if anything does go down, feel free to reach out. I swear I'll do whatever I can to help. <laughs> we will. See you, Phantom Thieves. Or, no, you damn kids. There he goes. Zenkichi's great showdown in our world is about to begin. I'm sure he'll be fine. We ought to get going. Yep, home sweet home awaits, along with a nice big helping of Sojiro's curry. Looks like our journey's finally coming to an end. And yet I still get bond points. <laughs> Zenkichi is a Scooby-Doo fan. Old man! Uh, we're home! And I'll tell you about the other old man! What were you thinking? Coming home a day late? You didn't even call to let me know. I mean, you know, got a little sidetracked. Just a, just a tiny bit. Just a smidge. <laughs> Ah, uh, I missed you, Sojiro. Sheesh. Well, at least you guys are safe. Welcome back, kids. Oh, and you too. Meow. It's good to see you, old man. Uh-huh. Hope you had fun. Sojiro, it was amazing! There's so much I gotta tell you! Too wiped out today. I just want to eat until I pass out into my curry. <gasps> Sojiro. Curry. <laughs> Already got it ready for you. Just give me a sec to heat it up. <sighs> Sojiro, you're the best. Ah, that aroma of coffee and curry. This place really is comforting. Coffee and curry? Does that mean boss is behind the counter? Oh yeah, you two never met. Huh? Haven't I heard that voice somewhere before? Oh, that's right. I never had the chance to introduce myself. Nice to meet you, Sojiro. I'm Sophia, humanity's companion and a member of the Phantom Thieves. Oh, Sophie. You can't just say that to any- I mean, you can say it to him, but you can't just say that to anyone. Also, how the hell is he gonna react to this? <laughs> we don't even get to see! Ha! <laughs> All of us, Sophie included, had a great time talking about the fun we had on our road trip. <laughs> Sophie is adorable, she is. Oh, hello. You have accomplished your goal with magnificent aplomb. Despite all manner of hardships, your bonds and your fortitude staved off the oppressive darkness, shining brightly for all humanity. Hey, you know what they say, third time's the charm. You have again broken free from the shackles of fate and grasped your future for yourself. As a result, the god sought by many has returned to the void. Some may be lost without it, with nary a hope to cling on to. Be that as it may. I believe the blazing will that you fostered throughout your journey has been embedded deep within the hearts of mankind, and will surely blossom into hope for them when they most need it, allowing them to face their own challenges with strength. And grace. Sojiro blacks out the end. Credits roll. <laughs> Lavenza's smile gives me life. I just want to give her head pats. Look how head pattable her head is. It's the perfect height. It's optimal head pat height. Thank you, Trickster. Allow me to praise you in my master's stead. You were truly a remarkable guest. You don't hang out here alone, do you? You got a place to go. Somewhere to hang out. 
May our paths cross yet again one day. Until then, sweet dreams. I'll be really sad if this is... Okay, bye. <laughs> Lavenza is made for head pats, to be honest. She really is. Still weird we don't get an explanation as to uh -uh. where Igor is, right? I mean, he's just done. Yeah. I, I told you, he's with the Persona 6 protagonist right now. Man's busy. This crazy summer's given us a whole lot of grief. But our mission was a success, and we made a bunch of great memories together. So, let's get this celebration going! Woo! Applause! Applause! <laughs> Golf claps, everybody! Applaud, chat! Were you not listening? The whole time Eagle was chilling on the beach with a margarita. <laughs> Fully dressed in his suit. That's a view that I want to see. What's wrong, Ryuji? You don't appear to be your usual self. Man, I could not fall asleep last night. Ugh, my bed at home just wasn't doing it for me. I got ya. Our bodies are all specced for the Feathermobile at this point. I swear to God, that is like the third time you've changed its name. I find myself missing the Feathermobile, too. Why'd you change the name when we don't even got it anymore? Isn't it called the Phantomobile? That was true. At least for a little while. Anyway, it looks like nobody besides us thieves remembers what happened at the Tokyo Radio Tower, just like last time. Ugh, that sucks. Considering it was our asses on the line and all. But it's always better this way. Controlling society from the shadows, slaying evil in secret? I admit it sounds rather alluring. Well, yeah, but don't you want some kind of recognition every once in a while, too? You know, like fangirls and that kind of stuff. Having fangirls? I wouldn't know that feeling. Nope, couldn't be me. Right, chat? Anyway. <laughs> I'd had enough of that already. What? Screw you! You're Mr. Superstar over here! The girls in your hometown probably go crazy for you, don't they? Still, we made all sorts of unforgettable memories. I couldn't have asked for anything more. Same here. It was a new experience at every turn. It was the best. Well, I guess I'm a punching bag of yours of sorts. That gives off a really bad impression, Fox. <laughs> <laughs> you get bros fawning over your gains. That is also very true. I do accept bro fawning for it as well. Fawning of any kind is pretty okay. Mm -hmm. And we can rest easy knowing we did everything we could to help. Any loose strings left are in the middle of being wrapped up. Oh, man, Gramps would have really helped to turn this party up, huh? I bet he'd say he's too busy trying to bring in Owada to attend a celebration just yet. So we're all partying while Zenkichi's still busting his buns on the case? Now I'm feeling a bit guilty. Hey, what doesn't know won't hurt him. Maybe because you remembered school starting back up soon? And doesn't that go for all of you? Oh, yeah, that reminds me. When are you heading home? Tomorrow. Yeah. Huh? Really? Time sure did fly by. Hey, don't worry. We'll be back. Well done, man. And make it soon, okay? Sophia, will you be joining them? You got it. And what if she ends up sniffing out of jail in his hometown, huh? <sighs> like that would ever happen. Now that you mention it, I wonder why Sophia was in the Shibuya jail anyway, of all places. Good point. Well, Ichinose did mention that she used to live in Shibuya. Perhaps Sophia was originally located within her house. So, when Emma picked up on Sophia's existence from the Metaverse side, that cognition... Ah, this is all speculation. And even if that's how any of it worked, it'd have to be some sort of miracle. Since we're on the topic, 
Sophia, you seemed a bit distracted after we defeated the Demiurge. Did something happen? Oh, that. I heard Emma's voice. Emma? Huh? You mean the one only you can hear? Yes. I was issued a final request. Please follow your heart to save humanity. Emma asked you that? Had we been able to reach a mutual agreement, perhaps Emma could have followed Sophia's path rather than face destruction. I believe this is proof of the true power that the Phantom Thieves hold. Artificial intelligence is not the enemy of mankind. We were born to help people. But just like people, we are capable of errors in judgment and can stray from the right path. Our users, their input, our experience, these all mold us to take a wide variety of beliefs. Well, being a verbal punchy bag is how friends show that they care sometimes. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> that was the stereotypical joke which I remember, which was like, um, it was like, what was it? It was, how girls speak to each other. Ah, oh, see you, love you, goodbye, as she leaves. Wow, what a bitch. Yeah, I know, right? And then with du with guys. Haha, <laughs> see you later, ba uh, see you later, you bastard. Yeah, see you later, fuckers. And as the guy walks away, what a good guy. Yeah, he's a real bro. <laughs> you know, just... Uh... I know it's a stereotype, but still. If only Emma had learned and grown with a good companion. Then why don't you give yourself the directive to show others how it's done? What? Since you're such a good companion to humanity, you can be a positive role model for how AI and humans can work together. Haha, <laughs> nah, my in real life girls' friends dunk on each other in real life constantly. That's how you know you're true friends, then. Oh. I couldn't even count you just how many dunk on each other with no regard. <laughs> but yeah, be a role model for all AIs everywhere, Sophie. You can do it. Thank you, everyone. Oh, but I can't leave this smartphone. That's a shame. Being a role model and helping countless people will have to wait. <laughs> Not so fast, Sophia. I've cooked up an ultra epic. Ah, shut up, shut up, shut up! This is getting too close to being a downer. This is a celebration, right? Celebrate! Come on, uh, Yusuke, you, me, soda chugging contest, now! Wait, what? I don't know if we're ready for that. Such idiocy. To think you could consume more than I. Hey, you better not spill any of that. Consume. <laughs> <laughs> don't have to like chuck it all down at once. You can take your time. You idiots! Oh, you got soda all over my fur! Uh. Not exactly the celebration I'd planned. But the celebration I couldn't go without. <laughs> Holy shit, I love these kids. <laughs> I love them too. Jeez, thanks for ruining the celebration for me, Ryuji. But it was fun. Everyone seemed to be having a good time. If only we could meet the Kirijo group, they would probably have a spare robo body line about. <laughs> Not yeah. The ultimate team up of Sophie, uh, Igus, and uh Labrys. Yeah. I guess I had fun too. So will the Phantom Thieves be disbanding tomorrow? Uh, we don't have a choice with school and everything starting back up. Ryuji and Lady On already have their plates full with homework as it is. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of worried. <laughs> Me too. And Yusuke? I'm sure he's ready to get back to his artwork. What about Metis? What about Metis? Okay, that's harsh. Metis! Metis is okay. The answer... P3, the answer is like a mixed bag, but Metis is okay. Koto and Haru are heading back to college. I wonder what life is like there. Yeah. I guess there's at least one more Persona of What do you mean at least one? Oh no, but this franchise never gonna die. 
Yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna milk this Persona 5 for all it's worth. Considering how much they milked Persona 4, and now Persona 5 has done like five times as better as Persona 4, like, yeah. I should play the answer. The answer is, I think it's okay. It's, it's okay. It's a bit... Overall kind of weak? A bit weird in places, but it's okay. It's very grindy, that is also very true. Hmm. College? I bet it'll be really fun. <laughs> they didn't seem too bummed on their deal. Sure, they complained from time to time, but it sounds like they're having fun overall. Well, based on my own experience. Yo, what's up, Digger? Hey! I know Otto, but that doesn't mean we can still bring her to the real world. <laughs> and Futaba yeah. seems to have gotten a lot stronger too, huh? Considering how she seems now, she's not gonna have any trouble at school making new friends. Everyone has found their own path. What's up? Well, I was wondering what my path is. You'll find it soon enough, Sophia. <laughs> Sometimes it can take years for people. Until then, feel free to stick with this guy and me. That's right. Thanks, you two. We're really heading out tomorrow. I still wish we had more time, but we ought to get some rest. Here we go. End of the month. Well, be careful on your way back. See ya! It was a real blast. Drop us a line whenever you're back. No matter what you're doing, we'll drop it to meet you. We'll be waiting to hear from you. Are you gonna be back for winter break? You know you could come back sooner, right? The attic's all yours whenever you like. It'll only cost you a few hours behind the counter. <laughs> well, I'd say that's a fair deal. You take care too, Morgana. Lady On, while it pains me to leave you, I must keep watch over him. See you later, Mona-chan. Listen to your owner, okay? No, he listens to me, and I'm not a pet! Uh how? You want to repeat that? You think you're the top in this relationship, Mona? I can throw you in the back whenever I want. Never forget that. <laughs> Keep an eye on these two for us, okay, Sophia? Okay, I've got it. <gasps> I almost forgot! What's the matter? I have a present for Sophia. A present? Indeed. I didn't get a chance to give it to you yesterday. Oh, one moment, Futaba. There's a message from Ichinose. Poor choice of words, Niche. I think they're the best choice of words. Sorry if this is sudden, but could you meet me in front of Shibuya Station? Bring everyone else too, if you can. I promise not to make too take too much of your time. Well, hope to see you there. What did Chinose-san have to say? She wants to meet everybody. I didn't expect that. Let's meet her. I'm curious. I admit, I'm curious as well. Are any of you too busy to join us? Not at all. In fact, this seems right. Yes, one last little farewell trip together. Hmm. This is bestiality, yeah. She said to meet her here, not. right? <laughs> yeah, but I don't see her. Maybe we just meet her here. What do you say we wait for a bit? So hot, melting. I'm evaporating in five seconds. Don't worry, I'll be sure to scrape up the puddle off the ground and put it in the room. Uh, perhaps we could find a spot to stand away that isn't directly in the sun. You got a sun hat, Haru. Huh? Wait, look at that! We now bring you breaking news. A shocking turn of events in the political realm. Moments ago, an arrest warrant was issued for legislator Jun Owada. The charges against Mr. Owada 
span from bribery and tax evasion to... Of course the son of a bitch had tax evasion. Also, holy shit, Zenkichi, good work. A fleet of police vehicles have encircled the Diet member's office building, which is reportedly being searched at this time. Man worked fast. We now take you to the investigation team's press conference, live at their headquarters. We have uncovered evidence that shows Mr. Owada illegally accepted funds from the company Medis. Additional investigations into his numerous other charges are currently underway. Regarding the specific hit-and-run incident two years ago, wherein Mr. Owada's secretary claimed to be the culprit, we have learned the true culprit was Mr. Owada himself, driving his own vehicle while under the influence of alcohol. The concealment of this fact involved multiple high-ranking members of the police force, all arrested for conspiracy to conceal evidence. I cannot apologize deeply enough for the flagrant, abysmal disregard for truth and justice from this department. We intend to follow our investigations to the absolute end, not only for justice's sake, but for that of the people and their faith in the police. Whoa, is, is this real? Wait, that Owada? And the police were in on it? Isn't this, like, a huge deal? Furthermore, there are claims that Mr. Owada's criminal activity extends well beyond that with Medis. Man. <laughs> kind of mimics what's happening in my own country, kind of, a little bit at the moment. Well, at least the faith in the police part. Including suspicions that he ordered the murder of his secretary two years ago. As well as... Uh, isn't that... Senkichi-san did it! He finally got the person he's been after for so long! Score one for Zenkichi. Yeah, Gramps pulled it off! That dude really is badass! The perpetrator's finally caught under the light of truth. A job well done. Looks like he wasn't just trolling us about his skills. No wonder he made such a good part of our team. <laughs> back? Welcome back! Soaping a water up on a silver platter. He's finally avenged his wife. Yep. Just like he promised Akane. Not only was the killer caught, he was the one who collared him. I'm so happy for Zenkichi-san. Hey, been waiting long? Ichinose-san! Wrapping up the paperwork at the police station took a lot longer than I'd expected. Police station? Did you help out? I actually went straight there and turned myself in the moment we finished our conversation. Oh! Hang on, but what you did was... Kanoe was the one who abused Emma's power. If you turned yourself in over all that... Setting Emma loose upon the world like I did would have led to its destruction if not for you all. I know that's true. Not only that, there's no denying I directly hurt you all as well. I thought I should be punished for that. At the very least. Ichinose! So, I confessed everything to the police. <laughs> Big surprise. They didn't believe anything I said. Well, it's not exactly the easiest story to buy. I even tried to get Hasegawa-san to help with my confession. <laughs> he just laughed it off. The police are too busy for fairy tales right now. That sure sounds like Zenkichi. <sighs> anyway, I originally planned to do this once I was released from jail. But I'm thinking of taking a journey of my own. A journey, you say? Yes, a sort of quest to learn about the human heart. <sighs> I thought Emma really would guide humanity to a better world. But once Sophia changed my mind, that was when I noticed something. The eyes of everyone saved by Emma. They just looked cold and dead. But you all, Sophia included, your eyes were so brimming with hope that it opened my own. Sophia learned about the human heart by joining you on your journey. You shared good times and bad. You were there for each other when you needed it. 
and you learn to understand each other. I don't know if I'll ever be able to do that kind of thing, but I want to speak with other people about the heart we're learning this time. Try and really do it right. I just needed to make sure I apologize to Sophia and you all properly before I depart. I truly am so, so sorry for putting you all through so much pain. <laughs> well, I appreciate the attempt at turning yourself in. To be honest, I was thinking that'd be something that you'd try to do to try and atone. But you know what? This journey of redemption could be good for you. Eh, don't sweat it. It's in the past now, anyway. He's right. It's all been taken care of. We're not sore over it. Thank you. Hey, I have a request of my own. I was worried this was gonna happen. Really? What is it? I... Well... You wanna go with her, don't you? I want to join Ichinose. Huh? You mean go with her on her journey? You've all done so much for me. You accepted me when I had nowhere to go. You said I was your teammate and friend. You gave me a home. It made me so happy. I constantly felt warm and fuzzy inside. However, everyone now has their own path to the future. <laughs> no, Sophie, don't leave us with the cat again. <laughs> Thanks to you all. I've learned so much. I've even found my path to follow. The path I need to take as humanity's companion. I want to be able to lend a helping hand to anyone who strays from their own path. Just like you all do. I want to help people find their way so they can find their happiness. If Ichinose is trying to find her way, then I should be there for her. Just like you were for me. I want to become more like you, so I can be the self that I want to be. Sophia... Does that mean we're saying goodbye to you too now, Sophia? But I thought she was stuck in there. Mm -mm. That's not an issue. Sophia, do you remember the first night we met? That full scan of you in LeBlanc's attic? Well... I've only been able to hammer away at it little by little, but since that day, I've been working on a program to to get you out of there. Oh, dude, for real? I I tried telling you guys a whole bunch of times, but I didn't think it'd wind up being a goodbye gift. Mataba. Oh. Sophia's decided what she wants to do. She's found her path in life. So we should congratulate her and send her off with a smile. Right, Futaba? Yeah, you're right. Are you sure this is what you want, Sophia? They're clearly really going to miss you. Yes, it's what I want. But first, I need to hear it from you. May I go with Ichinose? Where's the secret fourth option that just makes me go, no, you're staying on my phone? <laughs> At least I don't have to give my phone up. Yeah, you got it. Thanks. Sorry, everyone. I haven't been able to show my appreciation for what you've done for me. Ah, uh, what are you talking about? You know that's not how friends roll. Yeah. Friends and members of the Phantom Thieves. Mm-hmm. You'll always be a part of us. Nothing could sever the bond we forged over such high stakes. And we'll never forget the great times we had together. I know you'll be a fantastic companion to Ichinose-san. Sophia, stay safe out there. Hmm. Thank you for everything. Thank you! Well, all things considered, have fun with a fun Dad, summer Dad. vacation. Let's keep at it, yeah. Sophia. You know you Stay can cool, call Sophia. anytime. <laughs> You'll always be a friend to us. Yeah. Thank you all. I promise, I won't forget you 
or our time together. Huh. We'll meet again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no matter what. <laughs> okay, no matter what. Goodbye. go everybody persona 5 strikers god why did it take two years almost to bring this game over to the west atlas i thought you were getting better at this <laughs> oh, i can't believe i knew like i knew this game was gonna come over eventually you know, because there was no chance it was not coming over. It was just taking way too long. It just took way too long. Good for Lion Man. As over... As overly, um, like, stimulating this game could be sometimes, especially with everything. God, it's such a good game. Muso game. It's just a, such a good video game. Not even just a good Muso game. It's a good Persona game. It's a good Muso game. It's a nice, it's a nice uh, combination of the two. It's a nice callback to the original idea with the road trip. Thanks for the field the dream card. I hope you don't mind if I save the uh, if I save the notification. Don't let me forget. If you, uh, let me save the notification for a bit later, just because I want to let the song rock. Never to be <sighs> I just hope it means we get more good spin-offs. One final part of Persona 5, Striker's Sip. So you're planning to focus on Yakuza or start- I'm starting another new game. But, uh, Yakuza, at the pace it's going, is really good. I have plenty of uh, episodes which I could create in the background. Uh, plus, I got a, another Yakuza session tomorrow. Oh, those are so good. But, like, yeah, no, I will absolutely be playing a bunch of stuff in the, uh, in the background as well. That's uh, Yakuza. I just, yeah, it's a really good video game. Like I said, it can be a little bit over, especially on hard. It's very clear that certain parts are not balanced for hard. Um, but it can be quite uh, overstimulating at times and very hard to follow what's going on. But overall, the presentation, the way it felt, the gameplay loop, it was really solid. Probably wouldn't play it on hard again. I'd probably play it on normal, but... Interested in hunting monsters? Yes, but I do. I will say this because I did notice your question, uh, uh, Rex, but um, I do have like the next few weeks mostly planned. So it's not, it's open to like adaptability. But uh, I do have a big idea of like what the next bunch of games I'm going to play up until like July are. That being said, I have a whole bunch of other plans as well. Come back and it's over. <laughs> what are you thinking? Okay, so this won't. This is not a surprise. So because I mentioned it before. So, just to let everyone know what's going on, uh, I'm going to be going back to Xenoblade because I got the epilogue uh, story that I need to play, uh, Future Connected. Uh, that's nowhere near as long as the original game, so that will hopefully take only a couple weeks. And then, by the time that's done, I will be close to a, another game release. Ooh. There. 
adapted to a hit drum as well as several parts of life. <laughs> it's about time we got going too, huh? Guess so. So we'll go our separate ways once more. It's a little sad. He's saying goodbye, I mean. Come on! It's never goodbye forever! We'll be back in a flash! Sure will! Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you all in Persona 5 Arena. Until next time, Phantom Thieves! <laughs> But yeah, what a damn good Musou game. What a damn good <laughs> video game. <laughs> now, Chuck. <laughs> water water, I did promise. <laughs> Here. Let me put the save. Let me put the clear data at the top. Now comes the post game. I'm legit. So I do know this game has some post game. I'm legit wondering if I do this. One sec. I have been awaiting you, Trickster. You have prevailed through many trials. <laughs> Here we go. Unfortunately, I have yet another request. Unbeknownst to me, a certain being calling itself a god has been generating distortions. It has grown to become a threat that is sure to stand in our way. A number of malignant entities have taken up residence within jails. These abominations hold such power that they threaten the safety of even this place, where we currently stand. It pains me to ask such a daunting task of you, so close to your decisive battle, but for the sake of preserving peace 